<laughs> What's going on guys? I'm Ryan Roots. I'm Allie Roots. And, and together, together we, we are Rally Roots. Roots. So eBay just recently updated their mobile app and part of the update, um, I don't think it's out for Android yet, but for iPhone, part of the update was they, they've um, put in this new feature called... What's it Background called? Removal Tool? I think that's what it's called. I think it's called Background Removal Tool. I think that's exactly what it's called. Okay, so I mean basically what it does is you take a picture of an item and upload it to eBay and magically it'll make the background white, which is how eBay wants the pictures to look. It's how Google wants the pictures to look. Well, it's how Google wants the pictures to look. True. So eBay is just trying to abide and please Google for right. search engine optimization, which is also known as SEO. Yeah, um, but since like, since 2018, um, eBay's told us that they want the, the pictures to have a white background. So I think this is their way of making that process a little bit easier. Um, so what we decided to do today was kind of put that new tool to the test. So let's see how good or how bad it is. Right, and I just want to add, like, think about how much better eBay as a whole is going to look whenever right. a buyer, right, for buyer experience, hops onto eBay and they look, it doesn't look just like a thrift store or garage sale. It's mm -hmm. going to look a lot more streamlined, a bit more like an actual... Um, if the tool works. If the tool works, it'll <laughs> actually make everything, because it'll be more streamlined, it'll look right. like an actual website selling right. goods and wares yeah. instead of people. True. Which is cool. Like Amazon, everything has a white background. Right. So, I think it looks much better. It looks cleaner. It looks more modern. And the items do sell faster and better. I, we can attest to that. We try to take pictures yeah. on white background. We always have. Um, we'll sense that they told us to. But yeah, um, I think the items sell better with the white background. Anyway. Uh, we have a vintage Rally Roots t-shirt. <laughs> oh my god, I cannot. <laughs> Circa 2017 like, Rally Roots t-shirts. Not available for sale. <laughs> <laughs> um, but what we're going to do is we're going to test the new feature with this t-shirt. Uh, we'll probably start off kind of easy. We'll put it... The, the walls in our house, most of the walls are gray. Um, so we'll probably just hang it on the wall first, take a picture, and see how the tool deals with that. It's just a, a plain gray background. Um, and then we'll get kind of more difficult and see. Try like a door, the floor, maybe some grass. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll try. We'll try to trick it as much as we can. We'll see how it works. Um, yeah, ready? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Well, first things first, we have to find a place on our very busy walls where we can... Well, there is no place. We'll have to take something off the wall. Okay, what about that? Can we take that down? Yeah, we can take that down. Fun fact, Ali painted this picture in a day. Yeah, in Australia. Good job. Do you guys get it? It's black and white and red all over. It's a sunburned zebra. Get it. <laughs> reading a newspaper. Oh, get reading it. a newspaper. Nice. Get it? I get okay. it. All right, take that down and yeah, let's use that. Here? Yeah. Okay. Make it look all right. A little bit of hair on there, no big deal. <laughs> So we are using a ring light too, so um, that should make the pictures a bit better. But I'm just gonna take, I'm gonna change my iPhone to square mode. So I don't know if you can see that yeah. the camera, can you? Okay, so change to square mode and I'm just gonna take a quick snapshot of this shirt. Let's see what we got. Snap. All right, so we have our picture. Um, I'm going to open the eBay app and load this up on just a regular draft and let's edit it and see how it does. Actually, you know what? Before I load them up onto eBay, um, let's just take all the pictures first and then I can load them all up at the same time and test it out. So let's take a picture of the shirt on the floor. This one might be tough, a little tricky because the background is busy. It has a couple of things going on, but we'll see. I mean, this is black and then this is a dark gray. So I don't know if it'll cut this out or if it'll pick it up. Yeah, so I got that picture and then we're also gonna try it out on our wood floor because it's also pretty busy. So let's see. And then let's try what a lot of people do when they first start eBay. Let's hang it on a door. See how that comes out. Lighting is bad. The lighting's bad, but it is what it is. And I'm even gonna take the picture with the doorknob in it. See if you can get that out too. All right, and then we have just a white bed sheet. We're gonna try that out. And then we're also gonna take this sheet outside and use the natural light outside. And we'll get some more pictures of it outside too to see how 
how the tool works with that. So this is like a nice wrinkly sheet. Let's see how the shirt does on that. All right, so on a white sheet outside, we'll get a picture of that too. And then we're just gonna put it directly in the grass too. Take a picture. And then one picture just on the concrete, on the sidewalk, in the shade. I wonder if we'll be able to get those little leaves out too. I think that's enough pictures to test with. Yeah, I really feel like we did a great mix of a bunch of things. We figured out most people don't have lights in their home, so outside, which one's gonna work best? I have a feeling it's gonna be in the shade. Almost everybody knows where concrete is to take pictures and can take pictures in the shade. So True. I think that was probably the best one we could have taken. Or probably on the wall though. Yeah, I feel like the concrete. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Um, why don't we sit down and I'll load them up onto the phone and then set the camera up and we can react to how they look. Oh, I yeah. like that. Cool. Let's see that. I'm going to screen record this so I can show it up here too. We should use zero as a background. <laughs> uh, all right, now we're recording. So let's load the photos up. So we have eight photos. Eight photos. So the first one is the one against the wall which it looks pretty good already. There's some yellowing up in the corners, see that? Yeah. Yeah. So remove background tool down here. Let's frame it up a little bit. All right. Hit continue. Boom. Whoa. That's perfect. That's Hit apply. amazing. Wow, done. Do you know how That's pretty amazing crazy. that is for just everyone? Look at this thing. That's against a black wall. Or not a black wall, that's against a gray wall. Wow. I'm impressed. That's very impressive. Good job. Wow. But that was the really easy one. Yeah. So let's move on to this one, I think is gonna be really tough for the tool. This is on our carpet. So let's click on remove background. With just overhead lighting, no mm -hmm. special lighting on this one. Ready? <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Whoa, that's not bad. Oh my God. That's not bad. I mean, there's like some little things in the corner there. Because but... it was dark, but I have other carpets in the house that it would have been perfectly fine. Oh, Wait. look at that. There's a little eraser tool. If you do the eraser tool, it erases those little things. <gasps> wow, okay. That's pretty impressive, eBay. Wow. and. Granted, the hanger in it is not a good idea for sure. it's a flat lay. But look at that. Before and after on that thing. That's impressive. Oh my god. I'm impressed. I'm very, very impressed. Thank you, eBay, for doing that. I feel like this is the best tool eBay has come out with in a long time. Yeah, because it's going to cool. make their website look better. It's making it easier for the seller. Yeah. Um, more affordable for sellers as well because you don't have to worry about lighting. Dang. I'm really impressed already. All right, let's move on to the next one, which is on our wood floors. A lot going on in the background on this one. So let's go remove background. Ready? Go. Wow. I mean, I'll click the little okay. eraser. All try right. to erase some of that. It's really like, hi, Zero. Oh, that took a chunk of it away. <laughs> is there a, oh, there is an undo yeah. button. It's still not bad, like, obviously you shouldn't take pictures on a floor like that with that much um, going on in the background. But, but for less than $8, you can get a white flat sheet from Walmart or true. wherever you prefer to buy a flat white sheet from. And after hitting the eraser, I mean, it looks fine. Yeah. It looks fine. That's crazy. That's crazy. So far, I would say A++. On this removal tool. And Zero hears how excited we are, so she's getting excited. <laughs> oh my gosh, dog. Okay, let's move on to the door. So, how many eBay pictures have you seen where people take the picture of the item on the door? More than you could possibly <laughs> count. Doesn't look great. Doesn't no. look great. So, let's see if this background removal tool can help that out. I have. there's a lot of shadow. I have low expectations for this one because the doorknobs in it. The and shadows. there's a lot of shadow. Ready? Yeah. Go. Oh, I left the door. <laughs> but with this eraser tool, can you get I just it tap out? It. Oh, you can too. Wow. Bam, gone. And then you can get the door out here. Oh, wow. Okay. 
Okay. Oh. And now we're good to go. Uh, what happens if you overlap on the bottom right corner there? Oh, it didn't erase the shirt. It just got the, oh my gosh. So from door with a doorknob to pure white background picture. That's crazy. Bravo. That's crazy. <laughs> Slow clap. All right, moving on. Let's go to the sheet inside. I mean, the way that it dealt with those other pictures. It's now gonna I'm, be great. Yeah, it's gonna be great, it's I think. It's gonna look fantastic. Let's do it. Boom. What? That's incredible. Oh my God. And that, it erased the hanger. It did erase the hanger. Wow. What? That is crazy. Oh my That's God. That's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, this is like magic for us. Excuse our excitement. This is cool though. I wish that they had this years ago. This is crazy. This is amazing. All right, now we'll do the sheet outside. Hit continue. Continue. Boom. <gasps> wow. Looks good. I mean, there's some it shadows down shadow. there. Let me see if I can erase that. Yeah. Oh. Oh. The eraser tool, I think, is still a bit touchy, but it's doing a great job. And that picture looks fine. Yeah, that looks great. Yeah. Well, I mean, it doesn't. It, it doesn't look like great. lumpy, but <laughs> compared to what it looks like before, yeah, it's great. All right, now this one I don't think eBay is going to be able to get. No, it's a shirt on grass. Yeah. I think there's too much going on here. The shirt looks terrible. The shirt anyways. looks bad, but let's give it a shot. Continue. Yeah, and fail. <laughs> so fair. If That's you a fair if you want to use this tool, don't take the picture of the shirt on grass. Which, that would be insane if it picked it up. Yeah. If it was a white shirt on grass, I think it would have been fine. Yes. And then lastly, the t-shirt on concrete. I think this one's going to be perfect. I think that this was the best way to do the photo because one, the sun is free. Two, almost everyone knows where concrete is. And three, just concrete and shade is not a difficult thing to find. Right. So then, um, what do you think about the leaves though? That was my concern because there's leaves in this picture. Do you think that the tool will get them out or do you think I it'll do. leave? Okay. I'm going to say think it's going to leave, leave it. <laughs> okay. I think it will leaf them in. Yes. And then <laughs> we'll have to use the eraser tool. So let's find out. Ready? Mm -hmm. Go. Wow. It took them out all except for one little one down there. Because it was touching the shirt. Yeah. Oh my goodness. And then I can just hit the eraser. Boom, that looks great. So take pictures on concrete outside and use this tool and you're set. That's amazing. Yeah, but not with a hanger in it for sure. Just for sure. throwing that in there. Yeah. So there you go. We have before and afters now of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight shirts. I think looking at this, um, I mean, to me, the best one is probably, they're all, they actually all look pretty good. The flat lay. You think this one? I think we just smooth them out really nicely. I, I'm kind of like, I like the hanger in the picture. So my favorite's going to be the hanging one on the, the gray wall turned white. I think that it just looks more natural. That's fair. But I know you like the flat lay one a bit more. Definitely. So, yeah. Cool. Well, there you go, guys. This tool is amazing. It's free. It's free. By the way, we're not being paid by eBay to say this. This was a legitimate review. We went around and tested it as much as we could. We tried to break it. And we had a feeling that a lot of people didn't know about this and they should know about it because sometimes things have happened in the past with eBay and we've updated people and everybody was like, thank you for telling me because I have a lot going on in my life. I don't know what's going on. Mm -hmm. I'm not following people on you know, YouTube and Instagram just to see what changes there are on eBay, but I'm following you guys. And when you mentioned the changes, I figured, you know, I learned. Yeah. So, and I know a lot of you guys won't have this tool yet. Make sure that you update your app because um, what happened is I had to update my app and then I only got the tool on there like two days after I updated oh. it. Um, and then I know it's not out for Android yet, like I said. So just be, be patient. It's a great tool. You guys should absolutely be using it. So I think it's awesome. For anything. Big time saver. That you want to remove the background of. Yeah. There you go, guys. <laughs> um, do me a favor and hit the thumbs up button on this video. If you know any eBay sellers, please share this video with them. Um, if you're in any like Facebook groups with resellers, please share this video so that everybody knows that this tool is active. Um, and if you have photos already, 
right? Right. With you can go not anywhere. like great background, maybe your lighting wasn't so good, True. but the color of the item is perfectly fine and the picture of the item is fine, just yeah. the background's not so great. Maybe go in and edit some of your old photos to make your listings more um attractive more attractive and more competitive yeah. with other people's listings and just for the market in general and we did hear from directly from ebay they said that it's fine if it's just the first picture that you do it on you don't have to do it on all the pictures in the that's listing right because that first one that's the only one that's indexed on google so um, you can just go do it back on the first pictures and it only took a second it's amazing so and yeah. think about how long it'll take you for just the first picture of like a high-end item right mm -hmm. it's worth it sweet so thank you for the tool. Appreciate it, eBay. Yeah. And again, guys, thumbs up button. Subscribe for more videos like this. Hopefully this helped you guys out. <laughs> we'll see you next time. I'm Ryan Roots. I'm Allie Roots. Together, Together we, we are, are Rally Roots. Roots. Peace out, guys. Peace.